The battle of the two Neros rages on, and both are having good days. First, the Cabal Nero up 15% today. Very nice, $91 million market cap, and consolidating very nicely in the last week at 80 to $90 million levels. This coin, this chart is looking pretty good. We'll get to the new developments later, but first, it is Nero CTO once again stealing the show. Number one top trending on Dex Tools, up 55% today at a $523 million market cap. Yes, this is the first CTO coin to even come close to these levels, let alone break 500 million. This puts it in mug, bread categories. And if we pull back to the full multi-month chart, if you don't remember, it was at 10 to 15 million for months. Then it had the shock listing on Binance last week. It shot up to 300 million. Then at this point, a lot of people actually enacted shorts on this coin. The reason being that if it was listed on Binance, no other announcement in the future would be able to top that so it can only go down, right? wrong as this chart shows it shot up again today so what happened well a lot of it has to deal with what was spoken on this twitter space from the team yesterday i listened to it so you don't have to the first big thing mentioned was that the team said at token 2049 they met people from binance and also from other exchanges that they're not going to mention because discussions are ongoing and they indeed posted a picture with here's robotic community member and rachel conlon the cmo of binance so clearly when the team actually says something happens it did happen. They have photographic proof. So which exchanges could they be talking to? Probably not Coinbase since Coinbase and Binance are head to head. Coinbase wasn't really at token 2049. They, a lot of times they don't list the same coins, but Bybit, OKX, they were both at token 2049. KuCoin, they list a lot of meme coins. Could be any of those. So the team is in talks with other top exchanges and listings may be coming very soon. The next big announcement <clears throat> on the spaces was that they are being listed by a huge meme coin and it is on Tron and they met people from this exchange at Tron so that today it turned out to be Sundog. So Nero CTO and Sundog, that is a $320 million market cap coin, is the highest coin, highest biggest coin on the Tron exchange. They are now partners. This is a perfect symbiotic partnership. You can tap into each other's communities from completely different parts of the globe and then completely different uh, blockchains. I am a huge, huge fan. Then some smaller up partnerships. Nero CTO will be listed on BitTrue Spot. They will be listed on Orange X Futures. They will be listed on L Bank Futures. In a payment partnership, you can pay for goods with your Nero CTO on a payment card put together by Zignali. Also, uh, Nero CTO will now be listed on a sports betting platform, BC Game. Nero CTO remains committed to animal charities as well. It looks like just a few days ago, a community member donated $5,000 to helping animals in Myanmar. It's a primary focus of them going forward. And remember, this and all the small partnerships I just mentioned, they just happened in the last four or five days. So this project, Nero CTO, they are run like a fully functioning company. I'm liking what I'm seeing in the long run. Now let's move to the other one, Cabal Nero. It's mostly referred to or Nero on Ethereum as their handle there. Good day as well, up 15%, up even more than the start of the video, $91 million market cap currently. Look at the Twitter page, it's just nonstop action as well. Here they have a trading competition going on on Maestro Trading Bots. Here they have a giveaway on Orbit Official, it's a spot exchange, another trading competition on Houdini Swap. It also looks like they made a representation at Token 2049, just like Nero CTO did. This one, Cabal Nero put on a pause and Paradise side event. A couple days ago, on September 20th, it was an actual party, come, bring your dog, donate money to the charity, and they hear the pictures from the event. They raised $11,000 to help a local animal paramedic. Very cool. They also, the project also made a rep, uh, an appearance at Meme Coin Summit next door. That was another side event at Singapore. They exhibited a table, as you can see. They spoke in some panels, and they also talked to the representatives of OKX, as you can see, and they are not listed in OKX. Cabal Nero is listed on Bybit, Gate, Huobi, KuCoin. That's four top tens not OKX, and they're listed on Binance Perpetuals, but not Binance Spot. So those are the two spot listings you want to watch for coming out. OKX, maybe it'll happen soon. They just met the team. Binance Spot, we shall see. If Binance lists the Perpetuals, they clearly like this coin as well. And that is it for the two Neros, guys. So drop a comment down below. Let me know which project you think is better. I'll be back later with a new video. Ben Crypto signing out. Catch you later.